Hello there, fellow survivors. This is Belsitania, your last good survivor, and we're back with seven days to die. Dishong Tower Challenge, day 12. Hello there, everyone. This is Editing Belsitane. I'm here to give you a memo real quick. I have been working on some modding on seven days to die, and I wanted to get your guys' opinion. First of all, for the new subscribers, thank you for subscribing to the channel. I truly appreciate the support. Uh, mods that I've been working on are um, ways to get the uh, corn seeds and tree seeds, uh, be able to craft them using plant fibers and clay, be able to craft uh, engines, headlight, uh, headlight lamps, and uh, weapon parts like the uh, bow parts. Uh, shotgun parts and machine gun parts stuff like that in the workbench and to be able to uh, forge recipes uh, uh, the beaker and some coal and in the cement mixer the ability to create nitrate powder using uh, rotting flesh clay and like wood and some other stuff to uh create nitrate powder that way um, if you guys like me to use it during the uh, Dishong Tower challenge let me know in the comments below and uh, we'll start implementing that um, after this episode so I hope you enjoyed it and if you do leave a like consider subscribing so you don't miss out any other content I may post and enjoy your day okay and we uh, finally finished clearing out the entire Dishong Tower. There are a few um, places that we uh, can loot once we uh, get to them. Today we're going to go all the way down to the first floor and start working our way back up. I just got done making myself 40 extra iron arrows. And so today it's just going to be clearing out respawns on the first floor until uh, there's no more uh, zombies to uh, kill on our way back up here and hopefully get some good stuff while we're at it oh that's right i need to break through this part here we uh Put the uh, sight mod on our pistol, and then the eight times scope on our rifle. Yeah. Okay, it doesn't look like there's any response today. Let me break into this. And we're in. Ah, not too bad, not great, but not too bad. Uh, let's throw a thing of wood in there. Day 32. Hey, how's it going, Big Mama? <laughs> oh, since there's no respawns here, we'll uh, work our way up until we find respawns. The trash I missed. Several trash. Why is this? 
interesting. Never seen that happen before. Alright. So this one's clear. Next one is 4 5. I don't see anyone here. We'll go ahead and loot the, the remaining loot crates that we have. Back over here, we'll drop off some of the stuff that we got. Alright, let's go ahead and pop open these munitions boxes. Well, before we do that, let's get our eye candy. Okay, here's the eye candy.
weird. Care package. And he gave back my arrow. Yeah. Or coins. Yeah, level up.
this floor cleared. Oh, yeah, it did respawn here. Right in the nuts. Okay, that was accidental. Alrighty then. Level up. Intellect. Physician. Alright. 
And that is floor nine. We cleared all the way up to floor 9. I'm not too sure. I don't think floor 10 will have any respawns by the time I get up there. But we'll check. If the uh, floor 10 doesn't have any respawns, we'll head back down. And then uh, start breaking into the uh, wall safes that we uh, left behind. And hopefully get some good stuff. Uh, we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, consider subscribing so you don't miss any of the other content that we post. And as always, until I see you again, enjoy your day.